Hey, um, another CGNMP tutorial. Uh, this one is going to be on looping. Um, you've probably seen it with Mystery Guitar Man, where he starts doing something and then the sound just continues. So I'm going to show you how to do that with iMovie 09 and actually also GarageBand. Um, so here. So first, what you're going to do is you're going to do your sound. Your sound is actually going to be separate from the clip. So here I have me, and I'm just I'm hitting stuff. Um, I then start here, I start squeaking, squeaking the ball, and you just keep, um, when you're editing this, sorry, you, uh, this little loop thing, and you just keep dragging it until wherever you want it. Um, so here I have the hitting, and then the squeaking starts, and then I have this kind of, I was, I'm not sure what it is, but I was hitting it. Um, and then, so then it kind of goes like this. It doesn't sound that good, because I was just making it for an example. Anyway, so that's that would be your GarageBand clip. Then what you would do is, I'm going to save this, quit GarageBand. You don't need GarageBand anymore. What you're going to have to do, though, is export it in iLife or whatever, so that you can use it here in uh, iMovie. Well, it's easier to access. Um... Uh, here. Okay, and then what you're going to do, this is the hardest part, is you're going to film yourself sing, pretending to make the sounds that they're doing. Like, see, I'm hitting the ball here. That's not actually the sound that I was doing. I was hitting my fist on the table, but that's just what I did for an example. And then the ball squeaking, actually, I'm squeaking the ball. But the sound that you hear, you're, here, I'll just show you. You're going to take this clip. Uh, take out the part where you stop it. And you're going to put it up here. You're going to double click or whatever. Um, go to audio and remove the audio completely. So there's no audio to this. This is you pretending to make the sounds that you made in your GarageBand piece. It's kind of confusing, I know. but um, So then what you're going to do that did not work. See, um, I didn't, I had, you're gonna have to, like, start it after. It's kind of hard. Anyway, um, so this is pretty much what it will then look like. You will probably do better in your synchronizing. I was kind of doing this quickly. Um, you're gonna have to adjust it and stuff because it obviously will never won't be perfect right away when you put it on. Um, and see now it looks like I'm doing it. Reality, I'm not. And it would, yeah, that it, it doesn't look very good. I know, but if you do it correctly, it will look very good. Like in the uh, example I had before. Um, it'll look like that, and so that's pretty much how you do it. Um, it's very simple. Um, I hope you like it. And this was like this is not the first one on YouTube, but the other one was for PC and was really complicated, and I didn't understand it. So I just figured I'd make one for iMovie with Grushman. Um So yeah, thumbs up, subscribe, do all that great stuff, and yeah, uh, suggest more tutorials and stuff. So yeah.